I uh, I can't remember what the name of the game was, but like, I don't want to say that it was like absolute hot trash, even though it was pretty close to it. It was just that like, man, the enemy placement was crap. <laughs> the level of design was okay at best. It's just, I don't know, whatever. Scooby Doo. Hello, Noodle. Welcome, love. Unmasked. There we go. Done. Done, done. Okay. Controller's hooked up. Let's go, dude. What do we got? Playing a Scooby game without Rue? I don't know if Rue's available tonight or not, man. Rue's schedule's been rough since they got a uh, new job and everything. Like, I guess I can announce it in Discord. Why not? Going live. Hey, friends. Currently live on Twitch with some Scooby Doo Unmasked heart. There you go. <laughs> it's been announced. You're welcome. My my public service is complete for the day. Uh, <laughs> extras. Do we have anything? Monster profiles, bonus arts, credits. I imagine we probably have to unlock most of that sort of stuff. Um, we'll figure that. Wait, whoa. Bat controls? Kung Fu controls? Wait, what is it? Robin Hood controls? What is this? Okay. Interesting. Oh, damn. That's loud. Sound effects, music and volume. That's all fine. No special options. New game. Let's just hop into it, man. Why not? Uh, sure. You can create a save file. Oh, that's not bad. Like a, like a light, a pastel-y lime green with uh, the the dark gray there, and the big eyes that you love so much. Yeah, it's not bad. I need to look and see if there's any new outfits for Bill. Cause we're still wearing like the Halloween outfit from like October, whenever. I probably put it on before October actually. I don't remember though. My memory is garbage, obviously, but it's been a while. I can't wait to meet him. Like, what is Jed new mm. Fred? He makes monsters. Monsters? You know what? <laughs> I just remembered I've got something on the stove. And me and Scoob have to go back. Relax, you scaredy cats. Jed works for a special effects studio. They make fake monsters for movies. This game is very quiet, isn't it? A St. Paddy's Day one would be nice. Just more outfits in general would be nice, but... Um... Where is it? Seeing if I can turn it up at all, but... I'm blind. There it is. I mean, I can turn it up a bit. All right, gang. Let's split up and see if we can find any clues. Hopefully that's a little bit better. Monstrous Fright and Magic. Okay, we were looking for somebody that makes fake monsters. And we didn't find them? I think that's <laughs> the story so far. It's kind of... I wasn't paying that much attention. I was messing with the, the volume stuff. Find the others and help them look for clues. Oh, you know what? I think this is the one... Uh, I don't remember the, the streamer's name, but... We, uh... We all went and watched a, a guy playing a Scooby-Doo game one night. Mmm... It might have been this one? I feel like it was, but... As always, memory, memory poor, so I can't remember. Scooby Snack Trails will usually show you the way. That's handy. That's just good design. Can we... Yeah. I don't know if we need the snacks for anything. But I feel like we should collect them. We have double jump. That's handy. Oh, we also have like a ground pound. And... And a weird slide. Wait. Oh, we can attack these couches? Wait. How do we roll? <laughs> it seems like the slide counts as an attack. So, that's handy. I'm still confused on how we rolled those, because we... 
Huh. You have no idea how that worked. Uh, whatever. We do have camera control. That's good. Alright, maybe we'll just, uh, go this way a little bit. Hi, Shaggy. Like all the Scooby Snacks in this room are making me hungry. I bet you can't find all of them. Okay. Is there... Is there a certain amount we're supposed to be finding? <laughs> they, they didn't mention it. Normally, whenever it's like... You need to find a certain number or something or whatever, normally they tell you. Is just me, or are we, like, clipping through this platform as we're... No, I guess not. It just doesn't provide, like, the amount of height that I thought it would. Collect 100 Scooby Snacks to regain a metal? What kind of metal? I'm not even sure where some of these snacks are coming from, man. They're just kind of appearing. Strange looking machines don't seem to be working. Some platforms make you bounce higher when you jump on them. Okay. I'll find a dandy, I suppose. Can we break through this wall? No. And it just already looked like a little broken, you know? So, why not? I wonder what the... Is that like bubble gum or something? What's the other thing that we're collecting? The little, the little picture there makes it look almost like bubble gum. I was trying to find out how to open this door. That's the switch over there, but I don't know how to get to it. Maybe there's a clue somewhere. Is that what this is for? The light bulb? Oh, no. I thought maybe, like, by touching that we would get a clue. Oh, okay. Magnifying glass there, clue. That's fair. So, a key card? Can we, can we break this creepy clown? No. me no we can't even go over to that one okay um can we use the key card here oh shoot <laughs> my bad can we go through the door do we need to talk to velma Sam any clues will unlock new levels and areas select a clue and press x it's usually what key cards do yeah it's some sort of key card Hey, imagine that. Now try to see if you can reach that switch, Scooby. Uh, why wouldn't we be able to? It's literally right there. Why can't I grab the light bulb? Like, it's... Uh, okay, whatever, game. Great job, Scooby. I'll go show this clue to the others. I just been jumping on them. This still bugs me. Like, that looks like that's a thing we can interact with in some way, but... Like, it's all lit up. I don't know, whatever. What was that? Press circle to perform a slide attack. More powerful than spin attacks, but slur. Oh, okay. I didn't realize they were more powerful. Can we slide, like... No. I was hoping since it was downhill, maybe we could slide even farther. But no, seems like it's the same pretty much no matter what. Oh, okay. Is this... Is this bubblegum? <laughs> oh. Okay, well, I think we skipped through that text there on accident. Can we talk to you again? I don't like this. Hmm. It's fine. I'm sure, I'm sure Jed will show up somewhere. Maybe he's uh, busy making his next masterpiece. Break all the stuff, please. There we go. We got we got the hundred. I think that's what we were aiming for. Do we need to go back to Shaggy? Or no, I guess we can't because it won't let us go back up the platform thing there. X to jump and grab cables. Oh. I don't understand what this... Gum? I mean, I'm not even positive it's gum, but whatever it is. <laughs> yeah. Bless me. I mean... I don't know, man. It looks like gum. I just don't see why we'd be collecting a bunch of pre-chewed bubble gum. 
Seems like a weird thing to be collecting. Man, it feels like we should be able to get up there. From here, without going to the cables. I mean, I can just go to the cables. It's not that big of a deal, but... Ah, get wrecked, game. <laughs> I spent twice as long getting my way up my own way. We go backwards? We can, okay. We just couldn't go up that gum slide. Jump on moving platforms to activate them. Makes sense. I've played video games before. I understand. Is there anything down there other than, like, what appears to be dead alien bodies? Oh, I wonder what this does. Ah, okay. That's what we're collecting ingredients for, for metals. So probably not necessary in any way. It's just for, like, pre-achievement achievements. Or this might be one of those games that, like, started on the, the Xbox or PlayStation 4 or something, you know, and then got ported. Or not 4, 3. I'm so glad and then got ported here. back. Gotta help Thelma. She's been cornered by these two huge rats. Try to scare them off. Scare them? I'm scared. Yeah, y'all really asked the wrong person to do this, didn't you? Play enemies by pressing square or circle, okay. Never would have guessed that we attacked to attack. This thing's moving a lot. Are we sure it's not alive? <laughs> Bro, there's definitely someone in this thing, isn't there? Is he like, did he like get himself stuck in the suit? <laughs> I think he got himself stuck. Oh, are the rats fake too? Good Animatronic job. rats? You've defeated the rats. Or rather, some sort of rat like special effects mm -hmm. creatures. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we haven't collected any other. Sorry. It just bugs me. Like, there's so obviously someone in there, but I can't do anything with it. Maybe we gotta give Velma some clues first. Restores your energy. Wait, are we capped at a hundred snacks? Could we snacks? Can we go through the conveyor belt now. It's too bad. That would have been fun. Oh wait, can I have grabbed that? Almost looks grabbable. Wait, where, where'd it go? Was it the light bulb? I might have just seen the light bulb. Yeah, I just saw the light bulb, which... I still don't really understand what the light bulbs mean. Maybe it means we turned in the clue for the area? Costume over there? It looks like the beast from Bottomless Lake. Impressive. It moved. Come on, Scooby. It didn't move. It's just a costume. No, there's definitely someone in that, dude. Now let's see what we have here. This key card must open up the answer to the... Remember, the more clues we find, the quicker we we'll solve this mystery. Where's the next... Oh. Wait, can we just, like, break through this, maybe? Oh, well. I saw that. I thought that was, like, what we were unlocking for the next area, though. My bad. Thelma, I found a camera. Is there anything cool on it? Oh, it's not a camera. It's a radio beacon. My bad. Never mind. Mm, they slide out. That'll make jumping across a lot easier. But yeah, this just must mean like this is interactable in some way. Like find a clue to do this thing. Nom. All the noms, please. I'm still not sure how. Is it just jumping? Oh. So, like, if we 
do a ground pound, but we're close to the ground. Then we do a roll. There. Oh. Chocolate bar? Well, is that going to pop up again? <laughs> I just saw it said press X to activate something. Was that a, a mubber converter? Is that what it said? So is this... Is it not... Is it not gum we're picking up, but but mubber? I mean, gum is basically rubber anyways, right? <laughs> like, That's what it always feels like to me. Just chewing on a bunch of rubber. Can I not grab this pipe? I mean, I guess there's... Oh, shoot. Glad there's no fall damage. Glass, there's no... Glass. I'm okay. Don't mind me. I guess there's nothing over there anyways, so it doesn't really matter, but... But I thought pipes were grabbable. Any food? When you do, just look for me in my trusted party kitchen, and I'll cook us up one of my delicious meals. <laughs> I mean, I I do. I have cabbage. I have ice cream. Maybe maybe you can make some cabbage ice cream. I don't remember what else we found. I'm sure something. Right there, old pal. Uh, chocolate, <laughs> peppers. Is this everything, or some like? Cabbage? Hmm, yummy. Uh, peppers, obviously. We need more ingredients. Okay. Wait, what? I was gonna add more. Sweet, sweet chocolate. And ice cream. Ice cream? Like what a cool idea. Getting there, but not quite there. We need more ingredients. Like Did we get them back, or? Or does he, like, bring the kitchen with him everywhere he goes? Hmm. Dun, dun, dun. Who are these people? Why do they seem vaguely familiar? Or were they just made of mubber? Like what mess did you get into, Scoob? <laughs> I call it mubber. A remarkable soy-based formula that can take any shape. And it only breaks down under UV light. Isn't that right, Marcy? With mubber, Mr. Stanton has perfected the most lifelike special effects monsters ever. And would you believe it even tastes good? Yummy! Mr. Stan, pleased to meet you. It really you. does just My look friend, like chewed bubblegum, man. Me, Velma, Shaggy, and Scooby-Doo. We're friends of Jed Jones. Jed? That thief? Look around. He caused all this so he could steal my creations. He reprogrammed the animatronics. Oh my god. And now they're attacking Idiots. people. <laughs> How can you be sure it's Jed? He's missing. And so's my mubber, UV lamps, some animatronics. That's all the proof I need. Mr. Stanton, I don't believe Jed would ever do such a thing. We'll get to the bottom of this mystery. Do you have any idea where Jed could have gone? He had a delivery to Chinatown for the New Year's parade. So wait, does that mean we did everything? Game completion 6%. So the game's not all that long then, eh? Unless it gets significantly harder later on. Which, I mean, I guess is possible. But we've only been playing the game for like 15 minutes and we're 6% of the way there. As always, though, I am curious. Scooby, not Scubby, Scooby-Doo Unmasked. Shiny. Jed's first stop. Yeah, seven hours, dude. Not long at all. Angry. Dragon. And you are? My name is Maggie Z. I'm in charge of the New Year's celebration. We're looking for my cousin Jed. He was delivering. Jeez. Where's Maggie? Maybe she's the dragon. Dragon or not, we'll solve this mystery.
That sounds disgusting, Noodle. <laughs> I, sorry, you know my opinion on peeps. Did my controller die already, or did I just not press any buttons for long enough? I could have sword. I had it plugged in last week. Press X or square to access monster profile circle to replay completed level. So we can go back. That's cool. Always handy. Okay, water's not deadly. That's nice. You thought it sounded good? Well, I mean, you like peeps, so that's fair. If you like peeps, then I'm sure it probably is decent, but... But I'm not a fan of peeps. As you well know. I'm assuming it's not possible to get in this thing's mouth. We probably... Yeah, shoot, my controller is dying. Son of a bitch, dude. I should just switch back to the PS2 controller, but meh. I have a charger over here. I got myself a new charger. Bro, somebody's angry. I need the cord, though. Son of a bitch. Hold on. Ah, gotta get up. You need peep delights? Is that what they're called? Peep delights? Still sounds pretty gross to me, but if you want to try it, love, that's fun. Wonder if this block, I, I just got it today. I wonder if this block lets you like charge and charge off of at the same time. charging cable over here. It's gonna work. It's still charging. I mean, it still says it's charging, so maybe. Uh-uh. Those are the chocolate dipped ones you like. Oh. Yeah, I wouldn't have known that, love. I, <laughs> I, don't, I don't follow peeps all that much. Not liking them has that effect on me, you know? But if you remind me, I'll try to pick you some up. Is there any, any like break these boxes? Can we get behind these boxes? It's just it looks like something's hidden over here, you know? Why else have a giant tower of boxes? No, I guess I guess it's empty. It's fine, okay. Let's just go over here, see what Shaggy's doing. Is this the, the porta kitchen again? Yeah, well, we don't have any more food ingredients yet, so... I guess there's nothing for us to do over here. The warehouse is locked. What's the... What's the warehouse? Ooh, can we go up there, though? What is up here? I, I want to know. No. I mean, I see the light bulb. We probably need to find clues and do the thing, you know? But... Is there any weird geometry? <laughs> Words. <laughs> Words are hard. Is there any weird geometry around here, though, that we can exploit to get up there early? Nah, uh, maybe not. Oh, uh, maybe. Can we get on we Get on top of this sign, the warehouse locked sign? Ah, uh, no, it's not flat enough for us to stand on. Damn, dude. I was hoping we could... Oh, maybe it is. Because if we can get on that, then we might be able to get on top of all those boxes there. And then if we can get on top of all these boxes, the ones that I thought something was hidden behind, then we might be able to... Oh, I even jumped off of it, but not on the right... Okay, hold on. I don't think... I mean, this definitely isn't what you're supposed to do, but like... <laughs> I want to do it, though! I mean, four links, peeps, peep delights, rice, crispy peeps, and warmable peep plush. Do you not already have a warmable peep plush? I'm probably mistaken, but I thought you had warmable peep plush for some reason. Hey, Scooby Doo. Hello. We need some clues if we want to find out what happened. Okay, we'll find clues. No worries. Hello, sir. I'm Fred Jones, and this is Daphne Blake from Mystery Inc. I'm sorry, maybe you should remind me this year, love. Pleased to meet you. 
My name is Ho Fang, and I own this antique shop. Of course, there aren't too many customers since the dragon showed up. Bro, you would think a dragon would draw more people in. I mean, I guess if it's like killing people, maybe not, but. What happened here? Oh, I'm sorry. I thought. Never mind. Some of the New Year Parade sponsors wanted a more modern celebration this year. They commissioned, how do you say, special effects. So, is that you admitting that the dragon's fake? I don't... <laughs> or are they, like, illegal fireworks? Is that what he's talking about? Oh, can we mix the hot pepper with the chocolate? Chocolate hot pepper... Ice cream? That... I mean, that doesn't sound terrible, honestly. Can we get to the, the end of the tail there? So I just noticed there is something over there. Ah, oh, no. Hold on. We can jump it out. Come on, game. Come on. No! <laughs> is there an invisible wall over here? Is that what's stopping me? There's gotta be, man. I just want to get the, the thing. What is it? It looks like shrimp tails or something. Yeah, no. We're definitely not meant to go over here yet. I guess whatever clue this is must let us be able to get over to there. Fair enough. We'll follow the things. There's a clue or something right here anyways. I just... I don't know. I saw a random thing and wanted the random thing. One of nine. Okay, so the level definitely got a lot bigger than the last one. A lot bigger, a lot more open. Great. There you go. You found a interesting. The Giant fortune cookie. cookie. Looks like some kind of binary code. Okay, and what does that do for us? Is that, is that the warehouse? Where was that? Is that over here where Shaggy is? Over here, maybe? That still says locked. I'm not sure where that was. <laughs> where did a truck hey, just move at? Oh, wait, hey, yeah, you. Cow. Uh, no, 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 not you. This. Right. Time for some cooking. Pepper. Hot, 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 hot peppers. Hot peppers, ice cream, and chocolate, man. I'm starving. This surely will be a hit. Nothing. <laughs> no comment on that, Shaggy? That's lame. Was it here? No. It was a truck kind of like this that moved, though. Wait. These Scooby snacks are new. Maybe we just follow them, then. When all else fails, follow the trail of snacks, right? There's so many, like, jumps that are so close. I feel like we could probably make if I was just a little better. Get a little more height, you know? Ah, here we go. Oh, that's, like, the next area, though. But this is where we unlock the, the clue, or what the clue unlocked, rather. Cookie factory. Oh, so it's like a bunch of... This is like a hub world for a bunch of smaller levels. Like one big world for a bunch of little worlds. Doors locked. Isn't that a... Is that a mubber machine, though? Or what is this? Find the silver kung fu coin to activate this machine. Or not. Never mind. Well, we can go this way at least. So let's just go this way first. See what this is all about, man.
Got a bop of a song going though. Hell yeah, dude. Find your way into the cookie factory. Bruh, you know who you're talking to? <clears throat> we need to get Shaggy over here, man. We'll find the uh we'll find the entrance between the two of us in no time. Like, can I go like over here? Aha! See? Got some eggplant. Almost missed that, man. Can't be missing no food. We hungry. Did he say rats or snacks? I'm not sure what he said. Are there any more that want to come out of here? Because they're dropping mubber. Oh, well, we blocked the hole off now, so I guess not. anything no oh I thought we were gonna jump we didn't just automatically jump I was so confused glad we can grab ledges on this one the last Scooby game we played we couldn't grab the ledges and it was weird to me Oh, that's a moving platform. Uh, does it move back up by any chance? Or no, let me up. Oh, damn you. Wait, is it coming back down? Okay, good. It's coming back down. There might be more stuff up here. I don't know. I didn't get a chance to look. Or not. Okay, no. It ended right there. <laughs> the line thingy. That we were sliding down. I thought when we had jumped off of it that like we jumped a little bit earlier than we did. But no. <laughs> we were at the end anyways. Smash. What? Bro. I spun him. I guess it doesn't matter. You can't spin these dudes. Fair. I mean, I tried to spin the other one. And it didn't work too, so I should have known better, but I also didn't... Oh. Oh, we're fine. Okay. I <laughs> also didn't know that they could hurt us, though, so... we plug this hole like we did the last one? That was rude. There we go. So it's more like animatronic rats. Does that mean we're like going the right way? That should be a clue in and of itself, right? I can't get over there? There's cotton candy though. Ah... Oh, shit. Rue, hello, man. Cotton candy for me. Really glad you can make it, especially tonight. <laughs> Scooby Snacks. Okay, so the Scooby Snacks refill our medals. That's good. Scooby Dooby Doo. Now. So far, I mean, I haven't played a ton of it yet, obviously. We've only been playing for like a half hour, but. So far, I think this one's probably the best one yet that we've played. Now, you have played the other two that we did, right, Rue? Maybe not finished them, but played them? Oh, okay, that just takes us there. I'm just curious if you have played all three. I'm just curious what your opinion on them are. You played all of them yet? Wait, like all of them, all of them? All of the Scooby games in general? Because I did look it up. There's still two more that I'm missing. First, First Fright, and, uh... Um... I can't remember what the other one was. You sent me one link? I'm confused. I thought you sent me, like, four links. Do you mean you sent me another link? Or that you meant to send me more links, but you only actually sent me one? Oh 
one more. Okay. Oh, sorry. I I am reading. I just didn't see that you said one more. My bad. No, I don't see it. Where does it say more at? Oh. No! Give me the thing! Okay. Thank God. I really do need to just, like, stop sliding off of... Or jumping off of the... The slidey things. The cables or whatever. Like... <laughs> Like, I don't think it's benefited us once, jumping off early. I just keep expecting there to be, like, I don't know, a secret halfway down or something, you know? But there's not. There never is. I mean, there may be eventually, but... but I'm gonna keep doing it. But still. Now, is it just me or does our Scooby Snacks... Yeah, they stop at 100. So what is the point of collecting them beyond 100 then? If they just... If they stop there. Ooh. Milkshake kit with a cute mason jar mug? That sounds fancy. Also, I bought the Callisto Protocol. I don't know if anybody's played it before, but... I found it for like 10 bucks or so... I picked it up a couple of days ago. It looks pretty good. I want to get it on Steam instead, or at least I wanted to, but the cheapest I ever saw Steam have it for was $17. So I was like, man, might as well just pick it up on the PlayStation. If I end up playing it, then awesome. If I don't, then whatever. It was only 10 bucks. you know what I mean? But it looked pretty decent. I don't know if anybody else has played it. It just looked cool. You love this level? So far, I'd say the, the level design in general is much better than uh, Night of 100 Frights. Night of 100 Frights wasn't bad, the level design or anything, but... Ooh, spiders. Those are new. Can we, like, break this machine, or...? They need to do, like, a Five Nights at Freddy's Scooby-Doo mashup dude <laughs> sorry it's just it's just because of the the animatronics like specifically when i saw the animatronics in this machine i was just like <laughs> it just made me think of five nights at freddy's so now i'm like they need to they need to just take the two and cross them you know i think is a milkshake kit with a cute mason jar mug i like mason jars i like milkshakes too but Honestly, I had way too much candy earlier, though. Don't really want to think of sugar right now, but... Ugh. I couldn't help it, man. I love Smarties so freaking much. Mason jars covered in peeps? Well, you know I don't like peeps, so... <laughs> I mean, a marshmallow-flavored milkshake sounds fun. I don't think I'd want a peep flavored milkshake though, if it's peep flavored. Cause peeps don't taste like normal marshmallows. Peep are I don't know, gross ass marshmallows, dude. That's the weird thing. Like, I really like marshmallows. I really, really do. I just I don't like peeps. I don't know if it's the sugar coating they put on them or I honestly, like, I, I don't know. I have no clue. I just know I don't like peeps. What are you? A trap piece? Huh. I, I could use a good trap right about now. Good trap always comes in handy. Wink. Peeps are better than marshmallows, but only the super fresh ones. I mean, you're entitled to your opinion, but <laughs> no, <laughs> they're really not, though. Peeps are just kind of, just kind of gross. <laughs> I'm sorry. Is there anything in here? No, okay.
feel like I'm missing stuff, but is that it? Is that the end of the level, though? I guess so. In that peat mug with the plush? Do it. Get yourself the peat mug. Oh, shoot. Okay. Didn't expect him to, like, fight back, I guess. Like, <laughs> not in the way he did. Like, obviously, I didn't think he was just going to stand there and let us beat on him, but... I didn't think he would have, like, some sort of breath attack. Oh, is it a dragon breath attack, though? Because, like, dragons and stuff? I don't know. Oh, no. I was trying to... There's... There's snacks. I was trying to get the snacks. Yeah. <laughs> Be here just not paying that much attention. That's fine, love. Have fun phone close. <laughs> the camera feels weird here. I don't know. It's just like a weird FOV or something. Wait, is that more Scooby Snacks? Oh no, that's the that's the checkpoint thing. Platform? Oh, bouncy pad. Same thing. So, okay, if the Scooby Snacks max out, oh shoot, if they max out at a hundred, then we probably don't need to really be gathering all of them that we see. It looks like a hundred Scooby Snacks just gives us what an extra hit, like automatically refills. Oh shoot! Hi. Automatically refills our medals whenever we lose them or lose one. Or well, no, because I don't know, man. Is a box of Scooby Snacks automatically a hundred? Because like we're filled up now, and we definitely lost one a moment ago. I don't know. I'm being too impatient with these <laughs> these spray things. Oh damn, dude. we're actually gonna die. I need to, I need to pay a little more attention to what the hell's going on here. Ah, oh. I mean, okay, look, I know. Oh, you're a dick. I thought we were safe. No, 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 no. Don't get hit. I don't want to die. Hold on, grab this. Okay, yeah. So that's like an automatic. Get a thing back. nothing down there I'm guessing doesn't seem like we can oh we can get in between them but no nothing down here no what why did we why did we take damage okay I guess we weren't meant to actually get down there the game didn't like us hitting our head repeatedly off that ceiling which I mean fair, I suppose. No, okay. Oh. oh, there's another one. Is that all of them? No. Please? Nope. Maybe? Okay. Whenever it didn't like instantly close when we hit it, I got a little worried, man. I didn't want like one to come out and just instantly kill us since we're on our last hit here. Oh, there we go. Give health. Thank you. We're cutting it way too close right now. It's very uncomfortable. Okay, I know another one's going to come out. Don't lie to me, game. Three? Nope. Okay. Four. Four seems good. Um, you hate the rats? They're not that bad. It's just kind of annoying waiting for them all to come out, you know? I wish you could just, like, close their, their rat hole early. Is 
there any point to these jump pads in between them all? Or oh no no no. Nah, it doesn't look like it. I didn't even see the spray thingy there. I'm so lucky. <laughs> Five in that one. Whoa, 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 what just, what just happened? Why'd we fall? Damn it, game. <laughs> All right, well, first death had to happen sooner or later. Instantly gets ourselves hit, good job, me. Why are these bags like ghostly and invisible and fake? What's up with that? Something feels weird here. Oh, okay. Good save, Scoob. Hold on, Scoobies. Scooby snacks. Oh, grab the thing. I just, I'm not sure, like, is this have something to do? Oh, I didn't see what the clue was. Can we see from, like, here? No? Okay. Can't tell if the, the ghostly bags have something to do with, like, the level, or... If it's just because they needed another obstacle for the game. Ooh, an apple. Oh, uh, we can't use... We have so much mubber, man. We can't use more of it. Lame. Okay. Get everything. Yes. Let's go, dude. Freaking masters of the universe here. I wonder if we have enough food to make another <laughs> ungodly creation. First one took two, the second one took three, so I'm guessing it's going to take four pieces of food. Like, it's just going to go up linearly like that, but... Oh, excuse me. like Zentua went into the sewer. Something about this mystery smells fishy. Keep a lookout, guys. I'm going to find Fred and Daphne. <laughs> Shaggy gonna I fall. I can't see anything down there. <laughs> yup. <laughs> Bye, Shaggy. <laughs> this could be a key to some sort of machinery. Some monstrous Fred and magic device, maybe. Maybe. What was the other one? Of mubber is shaped like a lizard scale. Mm. Maybe it's from that dragon. Okay. Mubber dragon scales, that makes sense. Oh, hi, Wait. Scooby. Hi! Shaggy fell in the sewers. Shaggy fell in the sewers? What I said, alright. Then he is lost. The sewers are Zentuo's domain. And oh, no. He's shaggy, though. He'll be okay. What do you know about this Zentuo? He is a very powerful ghost who controls the great dragon. He has cursed this city. You should leave. Do you know where I can find him? One does not find him. It is he who finds you, like he found your friend. I think it'll be fine. We can find him. Can we use his food station? No. Bruh. Not even allowed to make my food? That's rude. All right, where 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 did the clues unlock? One was a uh, forklift somewhere. I don't remember like seeing a forklift anywhere. Is there like a run button? No. That's too bad. It's not over here. Probably just need to follow the Scooby Snacks again. It did us well last time. What's over here though? I don't think we ever actually went down this way. Oh, well, there's, like, nothing here. That's why. 
a lock temple. Fair. Is this bad water or no, it's fine. And it looked a little smoky, but maybe it's just like steam or something. What do I know? Oh, oh, oh. Box of Scooby Snacks. Let's freaking go, dude. Really? Really do wish there was a dash button. We're not like excessively slow or anything. It's just sometimes it's nice to go to go fast. Sometimes I wanna I wanna Sonic it up, you know. Wait, can we not make that jump? No. No, we can make that jump. Come on. Yeah, there we go. I just suck. Silver Kung Fu coin. All Kung Fu costume machines are now unlocked. That's cool. Do we... Do we need that for something? There's the shrimp thingy. Oh, that's probably more food. Not a clue. Duh. Nice. We make the jump back. Yeah. Now, I'm assuming we're going to need to use the Kung Fu costume to get into the sewer. Yeah? Zero mubber units required. Press square to build Kung Fu costume. Gib? Scooby's got this, dude. Kung Fu Master. Perform the Mega Strike. Hold and release circle while wearing Kung Fu. That was sick, sick Scoob. Good job. Oh. Do we have, like... Do we have anything else? Do we have, like, a ground pound? No. Okay. Do we do the whole level as Kung Fu Scooby, or do we just use it to, to unlock it to open it up? Just fucking Super Saiyan our way into this place, you know? Everybody talks about Shaggy using 1% of his power to destroy the world. What about good old Kung Fu Scoob? Ultra Instinct Scooby over here. I guess not. <laughs> That's too bad. That would have been cool if we could, but it's fair. Invisible wall. Invisible wall. Okay. Blow stuff up. Yes, please. Oh, we're already at 100, though. And we can destroy the spiders from our mubber. But it seems like... Dude, the game just crashed. Or did my computer break? Nope. Wait, for real? Does the game have autosave? Bro, did it actually crash or did like my capture card mess up or something? I don't hear... No, I don't hear anything either. I think the game legitimately just soft logged. That's the first time we've had a game crash on the PS2. Checkpoint or checkpoints auto saves though. Like if I have to restart the game, I'm gonna like swap my view over to like direct from PS2 real quick instead of through OBS. Oh man, it is like unguardly dark on on that screen on like the direct capture for some reason. I don't know why honestly, but whatever. Anyways, yeah, okay. Thank God, dude. <laughs> That's crazy. I have no idea why it crashed, man. Sucks. Oh, whatever. Hopefully the checkpoints work then, and we'll be good to go. That's crazy. I mean, obviously, it can happen on any console. It's just like, hey, thank you, Noodle. I've never seen it happen on the PS2 before. In just like normal gameplay, you know?
it's I guess like if you were doing glitches and stuff like that, then it's fairly normal to have that sort of thing happen. But this is just normal gameplay. I didn't do anything weird or crazy. I just broke some boxes and killed a spider. Like nothing weird. Scooby, Scooby Dee Doo. Up name Scooby Doo, Scooby Doo, Scoop, Scooby Doo. Okay, Chinatown. Confirm. So this is probably what, like, right before we went in to the sewers. Then I don't think we lost that much progress. Oh, excuse me. At most, we might have to like recollect the shrimp and then go back to the sewers or whatever. Or no, okay, yeah, we are. We're we're in the sewers. Perfect. Now is that gonna happen again? So what? We just we just collected all this stuff, and then we we came over here and we. The game did like lag for a brief second there again, didn't it? So maybe it's just like too much going on in that one little area for the game to handle. I don't know. It's weird. Oh well. No real problems lost. I need to get the DVD remote for the PS2. Because the, the DVD remote will let you, like, turn the PS2 on and off and stuff remotely. I wonder... Hmm. Because there is, like, the home button on the PS4 controller. So if I'm willing to sacrifice the PS4 controller, I wonder if I could rig it up to, like, you press the home button and it sends the, the power signal over infrared. Maybe just put, like, a little infrared sensor. Or not sensor, but an infrared uh, light behind the light bar on the PS4 controller. I don't know if that's the sort of thing that anyone's ever done before, but I think it would be possible. Just had to figure out what kind of pulse the the official remote uses. Six mubber units required to build Kung Fu Cosmo. I wonder why this one costs stuff where the other one's free. Did I have gone over there first? Really? Hello? Lele attack just redeemed hydrate. was gonna have a little bit of whiskey tonight my wild turkey 101 but then i saw again that i still have the redneck red wine in my fridge still haven't finished that yet i still have one more glass in there of it after this i just keep forgetting about it so anyways point is so i ended up uh getting some of that instead because need to finish it okay i guess we just need to go through this door here or break open this door here. Yeah, there we go. Break the door down. No chugging! <laughs> I don't need to chug. It's my only drink up here. Well, I guess that's not true. I have a tiny bit of root beer on my my beside the bed over there, but but other than that, it's literally like one drink left in the bottle, and then my my glass of wine here. I don't need a chug. You can chug. Oh, that's a moving platform. This water, like, is this bad water or is this good water down here? Who are you? Can I, like, shoot you from over here? Nah, it doesn't go that far. Lame. Man, I really... Is this bad water? I really want to go down there and test it, but I, I feel like there's a good chance it just kills us if we do. Can we go over there? Yeah, looks like it. Wait, does this platform not go up? Oh yeah, no, you're right, Rue. You're right, this water is fun. Man, it looks like this water... Sh or this water, like this is a moving platform, but... I guess not. So wait, how do we get back? How do we get back up? I guess the stairs right here, huh? That <laughs> that almost makes too much sense. Mm. 
How do we get over there? I want to do the thing and the dude. I want to say hello. Maybe kick his ass a little bit. Can I jump on this sewer grate? No. All right, I give up. It's fine. We probably, I don't know, trigger something later that triggers that platform that looks like it should move. And then we get over there that way. I'm sure it's fine. Either that or that thing that it's telling us to to do over there. Wait. What made us lose our cost? Uh, no, 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 no. There's a... There's a button. I missed the button. I need to get the button. It's going to bug me not doing it. So what if the button does the thing over here and lets me get to the dude? I got to do the dude. A little warm in here. Button. Yeah, see? I knew it. Oh, wait. This, like, takes us back out, though. I probably don't want to go back out yet. Yep. Oh, thank God that we can grab ledges. Okay, where does this take us? I need to turn my AC on. It is, it is warm in here right now, bro. Rats? Oh, there's definitely rats. Where are they coming from? Where's their hole? There's their hole. <laughs> Show me your hole, rats. <laughs> I need to fill it with rocks. There we go. So I can get some more mubber. See, now I don't know which way we're meant to be going, though. It's nice when games have multiple paths, but they stress me out because then I never know where to go. Because <laughs> like, I, I want to get everything. I want to collect all the stuff and do all the things, but then, you know, there's multiple paths, so then I don't know which way to go to collect things and which way to go to complete the level. It's stressful. Never know what's going on. Oh no! Where am I? Wait, is this the very beginning? Oh my god, we gotta do it all over again. Because I fell and I'm stupid. Wait, have we been down here before? We haven't. What's down here? Nothing. Okay, just rats. Why hold no plug? Thank you. For letting me plug your whole game. I wish it did let us collect more than a hundred. I guess then we would have like too much life. And that's probably why it doesn't let us, but I still kind of wish it would. Now the button's still gonna be pressed, right? Yeah. I keep like spinning to get extra length, but that's not this game. That's like, I don't know, Jack and Daxter or something. <laughs> that we can get extra, extra length of our, our jumps from the circle, or the circle from the spinning. I mean, there's a lot of games like that, right? You do a certain attack midair and you can get extra length or extra height on your jump or whatever. But obviously, Scooby's not one of them. I mean, I take that back. You can kind of get a little bit with the... Whatchamacallit? With the with the ground pound thing. That Scooby has. Maybe not, like, that much more. But you can get a little bit more, for sure. What is that? Was that just, like, a, a weight? Look like just a block of iron on a chain or something. We 
we just jump over there? Nah, probably not. Not worth the risk. We'll probably die. Especially when, you know, it doesn't take that long to get back over here. <laughs> That's all we had to do. Like, yeah. Mubber? 30 Mubber to build Kung Fu costume. Do we need the Kung Fu costume here? Or is it just for, just for funsies? I mean, I guess we might as well get it, right? Worst case scenario, we waste a little bit of mubber that we didn't need to. But we usually have way more than we need for each of the levels anyways. What's a little bit of extra mubber between friends? I'm way too impatient. <laughs> Almost missed this damn jump getting over here early just to have to wait for the other one anyways. <laughs> like, uh. Ah, here we go. Break that bitch right open. Oh, God. There's so many branching paths. Okay. You go over to there. You just go over to here. Yeah, okay. Chocobo, what's up, man? I think this was the right way to go first, because it looks like it was just for some extra snacks and things. And nothing else. And then, that's what, a loading zone? So that's probably not the way we want to go probably but I can't quite tell what's at the end of this big path over here I'm just waiting for the game to soft walk on us again now honestly <laughs> sorry that's just so wild to me man oh 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 no 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 oh god that was scary we're fine though Found a trap. Just a can of gasoline? Bruh, that's an awfully dangerous trap for my kids' show, you know? We just got extra height from that. No. Oh, god damn it. Where are we? Back over here. That's definitely a glitch, though. Have I watched Mystery Inc.? Like, the, the YouTube one? Because, yes, I did, if that's if that's the one you're talking about. Did they ever put out more episodes, though? Last time I saw it, they still only had, like, the pilot episode, the first episode. They were collecting donations to try to speed up development of the second episode. But they mentioned that they were going to make it, like, either way. It would just take much longer if they didn't meet their goals. That's the one I'm talking about, yeah, the live-action YouTube one. I'm not positive which one Chocobo's talking about, though. As far as, like, a fan-made project goes, I thought it was really freaking good, but... Not the live action. Um... Probably, then? <laughs> I've definitely seen, like... As far as I'm aware, I've seen bits of all of the Scooby-Doo TV shows. Just not all the episodes of all the Scooby-Doo TV shows. Series from 2010. Yeah, yeah, no, I definitely saw at least some of it. Um, the apartments that I used to live in years ago. <laughs> uh, I was watching a bit of it there, I'm pretty sure, on... What was it on? Maybe VRV? Because VRV used to have, like, some shows. I don't know. It might have been on something else. I don't remember. But I'm pretty sure that I saw bits of it. It was more, like, from what I remember, it was more lore-based, right? Like, they were building it up farther 
like not just these are these are dudes that do mysteries or whatever but like explaining them and their their history and crap like don't ask how is that three yesterday <laughs> bro i have no idea <laughs> twitch be twitching man it's fine can we get up there or no okay can't go that way um bro i already blocked your hole how did whatever it's probably better not to ask questions just leave it be oh that's okay i'm glad this game isn't a huge fan of instant death pits i'll give it major props for that alone uh, okay this way i think i like the way regular scooby handles better than i like kung fu scooby kung fu scooby's fun but Regular Scooby just feels feels right. Wait, what's over? Is that a moving platform? What's over here? Looks. Yeah, you move right. No. Well, okay. I'm I'm positive it moves eventually. Look at this groove in the wall. The fact that it's like brighter than everything else, like. I wonder if they did that because in like the old cartoons you could easily tell what was going to happen because things were drawn differently, like completely differently. Ooh. Than the rest of the background art in the old TV show. So I wonder if they made like the moving platforms a different color because of that. They felt bad about you losing your streak, yeah. show fred is more obsessed with traps than you subscribe to a magazine called traps unlimited bruh same <laughs> i'm also subscribed to traps unlimited it's my favorite magazine <laughs> i'm also on the subreddit of course oh <gasps> you dick oh and then i pressed x like a dumbass it's fine cartoon got finished yeah there was no doubt that the cartoon got finished in my mind at least it was just the live action show i wasn't sure about Oh, son of a bitch, dude. I give up. Just go. I don't even care. Take my life. Um. What was I going to say? Oh, one of these days, I am just going to sit down and watch all of the cartoon episodes. It's like, there's been a fair few cartoons, <laughs> of course, different series. But, like, none of them are that long, though. The longest one is, what, like, six seasons or something? I could be completely wrong about that, but... I Oh, damn it, I'm tired. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's not super long. There just happens to be, like, multiple of them. Um, Okay, this way. Oh, we are on our final health. But it's fine. Are you, are you more food? Marshmallows. Hey, speak of the devil. There's some marshmallows for you. It's going to take me high enough to get anywhere. No. Guess we gotta go back? There's definitely, like, more stuff over there. Can we... Bro, I don't know. That jump looks jumpable. I'm probably wrong. It definitely would have been from up there. If we didn't come like straight over here. Let's go, dude. <laughs> I don't know if we're supposed to do this or or not, but got a clue. Oh, uh, does this go all the way in? Oh god. Okay, we're fine. Oh okay, well, it's fine. It's fine. I didn't see this. Excuse me, game. Is there like a game over? Hopefully we just keep going. Yeah, I was gonna say back to the checkpoint. I don't know, whatever. I just screw it. We got everything. Let's leave. I'm just gonna keep dying if I don't. Oh, 
we going from here? Oh, right here, I guess. Give, give all the snacks. With as much damage as I take, I need the snacks, actually. My own impatience that causes it, but damn. Is this like a shortcut up and down now or something, or? No? Okay. I guess, I guess it's just nothing. I thought maybe this is the was the platform that used to be down lower earlier. I don't know. Though. Please don't softlock the game, spiders. Oh, you're a dick. what this mupper machine is. Hopefully more food. I want all of the food game. Give food. Oh no, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, I almost said super shaggy. Uh, the Kung Fu Scoob again. Can I not? Bro, there's an obvious hole here. Let me close the hole. Damn it, game. I dangle a hole in front of me and then not even Feed all monsters to open the iron gate. I mean, I would love to, but I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be spiders coming out of here. <laughs> and, or not spiders, but rats. And it's not? <laughs> Will they not come out until we... <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. Wait, is this... Is this it? Are they just rats? Oh no, okay, there's other stuff too. I was like, bruh, if we're literally just fighting rats, this is kinda, kinda dumb. Can I close the hole with Super Scoob or? No, I guess not. Oh damn. Do we have more spiders? Oh, there's a chick. Okay, I think that was on purpose. I wasn't sure like if the game was dying again or <laughs> if it was purposefully doing bullet time. It's like we we've just we've never seen bullet time in the game before, so twas confused to say the least. Ah, now it rises up. Okay. And then we need to super scoop our way out of there. Can I close the thing now? It really bugs me that there's like this one random rat hole that we can't that we can't close. Okay, so was this it? Ah, there we go. Up, 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 up. Oh, hi, friendo. You're like the last one, but I don't know. More green? I really don't think the bullet time was necessary. The Matrix had been out by a long time by the time this came out, dude. Oh, I love pepperoni. I need to turn on my AC real quick. I'm warm. Wait, did we ever find Shaggy? Or no, we're still in the sewer, okay. Hope. Oh shoot, hold on. Uh pause. Okay. I didn't realize it was gonna be like one of these levels all of a sudden. So let me turn my AC real quick and then we'll do it. Damn. Oh. 
don't even think you got uh Still a lavender, I like lavender. Wow. Incense is weird though. It's like hold Anyways, uh, yeah, sorry, I don't know how much you guys can hear me, but I decided to light some incense. But, like, I don't know if anybody else burns inc incense here, but, like, burning incense is such such a weird thing. Because, like, all of the dust in my house smells freaking delicious, <laughs> you know? Like, it smells sweet, it smells good because of all of the, the incense, like, collecting in the dust, you know? Hell, half the dust in my house probably is incense, so, like, yeah, it is weird whenever, like, <laughs> you're dusting and everything smells just really good. All the dust just smells really good. We're going to die a lot on this level, I feel like, because i wanting to collect all the Scooby Snacks, even though it really doesn't matter. You haven't logged into Reddit since the third party purge? This week they implemented a three-phase po three pop-up streak. Vog in pop up streak. Bruh, sorry, I can't read. Sorry, I'm stupid. Anyways, <laughs> I've actually been using Reddit more often lately, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I don't know, I've just gotten really tired of like normal, like social media, and I have to have something to pass my time. Normally, I would just look at memes, but like, and don't get me wrong, I still definitely look at memes, <laughs> but like can only look at the same meme app for so long before I just need something different in my life. And I really like on Reddit the, the whole just joining subreddits and then only really seeing stuff from those subreddits and stuff. Like, yeah. So, I don't know. I've been using it a lot. Even though I do completely disagree with the amount they're charging for, like, API access and all that crap. It is ridiculous. But yeah, what is their uh, three-phase please log in pop-up streak? <laughs> I somehow haven't seen anything about it. I've, uh... Oh, shit. I saw they were doing, like, some sort of Valentine's card thing you could, you could make, but I didn't... I just didn't care enough to do it, so... Yeah. Still use it, you just haven't logged in. Ah, I gotcha. I am logged in, but like I never post. It's just so I can follow or join the subreddits that I care about and then just ignore the rest more easily. That's the only reason I'm logged in. I've never even commented on anything. I up and down vote a tiny bit, but like that's it. <laughs> nice. Tries to auto log in in three different redirects. Perfect. That's <laughs> They're gonna get you to log in one way or another, man. Whether you like it or not, you're gonna log in and you're gonna like it. That's wild. See, the reason why I think I didn't really, like, get that upset about the third-party purge is because I never used any third-party apps anyways to access Reddit. I've always just used the the website or the, the official app. I've heard good things about the third-party apps. I know that, like, you used one. I remember when the, the purge happened, you mentioning that. But, like, yeah, I don't know. 
just doesn't really matter to me. To be fair, I don't spend that much time on any, on anything anyways. So like, yeah. Even with Reddit being my main, like sitting on the toilet needing to browse something app at the moment, I'm still only on there for, you know, maybe an hour at most on my really bored days. Really, you have problems with the official app? So the official app is pretty much the only thing I use for Reddit. I don't have any problems with it personally. It just works for me, man. I don't know. Honestly, one of the things that I actually like better on the mobile app than... Whatchamacallit? Um, the mobile site is that I can more easily collapse comment threads. Like 60 hours a week, apparently. I'm probably up there, honestly. Um... Not the YouTube app necessarily, because I'm just not on my phone that much. But like YouTube on between PC, mobile, and my TV. My TV is the majority of it. But like I let YouTube run pretty much the entire time I'm sleeping, right? I, I watch YouTube to go to sleep at night. YouTube is my main form of entertainment just during like throughout the day, you know, make something to eat, go and turn on a YouTube video and watch it. Need to waste 30 minutes in between doing this or that. Turn on some YouTube, etc. I would love to know how much YouTube I use in total, like between everything, but I don't think there's any good way to track like on the TV. Although, Google themselves probably do track that somewhere. I could probably look it up there. I wouldn't be surprised if it's rivaling you with your 60 hours. Because even if we don't consider the 6 to 7 hours a night of sleep I usually get, I'm still like, you know, 1 to 2 hours a day, like, in between, like going to bed sort of stuff you know like that kind of time frame um lunch break i'll usually watch either that or or my own personal media files on on plex um so that's like another half hour a day so that's like two and a half hours um whenever i'm like just chilling in bed or after the stream finishes and I have nothing to do or whatever. That's like another half hour, hour. So probably like three, three and a half hours per day. So that's like four. Nah, I guess actually if you don't count sleeping, I'm only on YouTube probably about half as much as you are, man. I'm closer to like, I'm going to die again, dude. Straight up. Yep. Son of a bitch. Um... <laughs> Yeah, I'm probably closer to, like, 28-ish hours a week. Give or take. Need two things happening at once, so games and YouTube are cooking in YouTube. Yeah, my thing is, like, the majority of my game time, or just the majority of my free time in general, is this right here. So, like, <laughs> I can't, you know? I can't have YouTube on while I'm doing this. I mean, I guess I could, but... No? Because, <laughs> yeah. Oh, you do use it while you're sleeping too? Okay, yeah. So that's like another six and a half, seven hours. We'll say seven for easy math. So seven times seven. So yeah, I'm up around 60 then if you count that. Because seven times seven is uh 48, right? Sorry, I'm having trouble mathing right now. I'm really trying not to die this time. And then I said we were at like 20 something before. So probably 60 to 70 hours ish. Rough math, super rough math. There we go. Now, of course, that's assuming that YouTube doesn't auto pause. That's one thing that really annoys me about YouTube. Like, if you have a playlist on, after two or three videos, it'll stop playing videos. Um, just, you know, it'll just pause itself. Like, <laughs> which is super annoying. 
I think you forgot the eight, dude. Uh. <laughs> but if you just have like a random video off like the home screen or something, I won't recommend it. Eight ball stupid as hell. Bro, we need like a chat GPT or Google Gemini plugin or something. I wonder if any of the bots have that. And if they don't, why not? That seems like such an obvious thing to have in it. You know? Uh, okay. Seven times seven. 49? 40. Hold on, bro. I can't remember my times tables. <laughs> yeah, 49. Okay. <laughs> It's like that was one off. It was close. Like I says back, back, back of the uh, back of the napkin math while streaming. You know, I can't even word most of the time, man. How do you expect me to do math? <laughs> I'm in the middle of a fucking stroke right now. Give me a break, you know. Let me drink some more wine. <laughs> It's fine. Everything's great. You know, like that's the smell of fear, Velma. Fear, as well as fish, rotten eggs, stale rice, and uh, I do believe tarragon. Has anyone seen Daphne? Help! Help! I think we found Daphne. It sounded like it was coming from the temple. This looks like a bell you'd find in a temple. Maybe that. Um, what's I saying? Oh yeah, Chad GPT. That seems like such a. Such an obvious plugin to have in a for platform, a Twitch bot. Or just something something similar, you know? It doesn't have to be ChatGPT specifically, but any of those large language model AIs. Bruh, hold on. <laughs> hold on. Don't even... If, if, pretend that didn't happen. Give me a second. I was sleeping today. <laughs> hold on. I got this. Uh, it's right here. Nope, not that one. This one. Um, I have no idea what's happening uh, right now. I d didn't even read the question. I hope it's fine. I really do not care about that Streamlabs. I don't even know what that was. Uh, command. Question of the day. Let's all be surprised because I did not read what this is. I saw the word mashup there. There you go. There's your question for you. <laughs> this question's on a three times streak too. It's changed now. It's there's a new one. You can check it. It's fun. Right. Time for some cooking. Uh obviously, I mean I guess it doesn't matter what we put in, right? I want marshmallow. Like that's a great idea. Um like I still need more fish. No one redeem it? I can redeem it myself, I'm just saying. Marshmallow fish. Uh, pet pickle. Waste his effort, that's so rude. And, uh... And, and, and lettuce. Or cabbage. Bro, that looked like lettuce, that wasn't no cabbage. There you go, like I'm not sure what it is. Let's go. Give me all the metals. Okay, now we'll just put things in an order. Apple, cheese. I forget what I just put in there, but there you go. Excellent choice. And some ham. Is it all just stew? I mean, that's basically how I make stew. It's just I just take whatever random junk I have and I throw it in a pot and then let that shit cook. And it's delicious every time, man. Literally impossible to fuck up. Not literally, but might as well be. So wait, so we put this thing here. Did that do something for us? Now you're hungry? May I interest you in some uh, fish ice cream? I don't remember what it was, actually. <laughs> I cannot remember at all what all we put in it. Ah, I got it. I got it. See, what was what? What did we just? What did we just pick up? I missed it. 
<laughs> what was that? Uh, I'm sure it wasn't important. Whatever, it's fine. Oh, it's an upgrade for the Kung Fu costume. I didn't even know that was a thing. That's cool. So what was the other clue? The stairs over here. Go this way. What's up the stairs? And then... There was the, the clue that lets us get in the temple, of course. And then there was one more clue, wasn't there? Because then we get four? I'm pretty sure we got four clues. We already did that one. What's over here? I didn't even realize we could go down here, to be honest. Nothing, okay. This is just like, in case we fall, I guess. Fair. Sadly, no secrets? Yeah. What was the other thingy, though? I could have swore we had gotten another clue. Oh, now we're blue. So what's the upgrade do? Oh, we now have a ground pound ability. Okay. Okay. I started watching anything new? Not really. I mean, I'm still watching solo leveling. And I'm catching up on uh, that other one, My Hero Academia, but I haven't I haven't started watching anything new yet. I want to finish those for well, solo leveling. I'm watching like as it comes out, so I don't really care about finishing it first. But I want to finish uh, My Hero before I move on to anything new. New. I do have some new or just some things in general on my list though. If I Hold up crunchy roll real quick. I don't know why I'm there. I have Oh my god, there's R's in this. I can't do R's. Furin <laughs> Beyond Journey's End on my list. The wrong way to use healing magic. Tower of God. Tokyo Revengers. Uh Ayaka. Blue Lock, of course, because everybody's talking about that. The hundred girlfriends who really, 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 really I have no idea what that is. Oh, the Rising of Shield Hero. I need to finish that. Dad started watching that, but never gotten around to finishing it. I need to catch back up on Dr. Stone, too. Dr. Stone and the Rising of the Shield Hero will probably be my next two, because I started those and then just never finished them. Overlord's on my list to finish, too. But, like, I'll be honest with you. I don't really understand all the hype for Overlord. I don't think it was... I don't think it's bad or anything. I'm just not. I don't see what makes it amazing, you know. What's up, Scooby Doo? Like so many people told me it was such an amazing anime, and I was just like, it's okay, I guess. I don't know. It's not that into it. But I want to give it more of a chance. Uh, I do have Code Geese on here on my list. I was trying to watch Naruto again not too long ago, but. Where I struggle. I struggle so hard with Naruto. I just... Uh... World end. What do you do at the end of the world? Are you busy? <laughs> I have that one on here too. Will you save us? Oh, that's the full name. Okay. Code Geese 50 episodes. FLCL? What is FLCL? And Made in Abyss. Okay. Let me search those up real quick. I mean, Code Geese I already have on my list. Because, yeah, I know that's a classic that I need to watch. FLCO. Add to watch list. Okay. A fucking masterpiece? Well, it's on my list. I mean, if it's only six episodes, I don't have any problems, like, watching that soon. Made in Abyss. That one doesn't seem to be on Crunchyroll. So I may have to find that through, like other means <laughs> the only one that's coming up is neo angelique abyss tales of the abyss and the fruit of evolution before i knew it my life had it made <laughs> like and I, I don't think that's the one you're recommending so i do have flcl on there now
bittersweet ending, so beware. I got you, man. It's fine. I don't know if you ever read Chocobo, but there's a couple of uh, books from Japanese. Butter, no, no, no. Buttersweet, man. Obviously. Just like... <laughs> Just take a bunch of, like, creamed butter, you know, where you take the sugar and the butter and you mix it together and, mm, That's how I- <laughs> that's how I like to finish. Wink. Oh, I didn't know we could get the same ingredient multiple times. Now I just want to save, like, all the cheese. And just make a fucking pot of cheese, man. And eat that. Anyways, um, yeah, no, there's some books by Japanese writers that I absolutely love. And they all have bittersweet endings. Um, but anyways, I fucking adore them. Highly recommend it. If you're a reader. If you're not a re If you don't really read, then obviously, yeah. Don't worry about it. But um, I had that same dream again. Do we need to, like, do anything here? Or do we swing automatically? We, we swing automatically. Had that same dream again. Three days of happiness is another one and then uh i'll forget this feeling someday i think is the name of it the other one highly recommend all three of those honestly like three of my favorite books ever physical books no on browser yes yeah. so, well i mean personally i use kindle for mine but yeah regardless of how you read the only physical books i really have are manga i have uh basically a shelf full of over there and then um i think that's it like hold on one sec since like whatever we're wrapping up anyways this game's good though don't get me wrong i am enjoying this game it's probably going to go on the list of games to beat it is short it's only seven hours long but let me grab a couple things here real quick it's like great Your dyslexia plugin? I'm so glad I don't suffer from dyslexia. <laughs> it might seem like it sometime with how fucking stupid I am, <laughs> but <it's, laughs> thankfully I don't. Uh, but anyways, this is the the manga for I Had That Same Dream Again. It's it's a thick boy because it is based off of a, a novel. Um, but I fucking I fucking love this book. It's it's an amazing it's an amazing book. I haven't actually read the manga yet because I mean you know it's just the book but with pretty pictures. So, <laughs> but I do plan on reading that eventually. And then surprisingly, I haven't even read the book yet, but it's by the same author. Um, <laughs> it has a weird name, but it's it's another thick boy. But it's I want to eat your pancreas. <laughs> Look, it's a weird ass name, but I I got the manga. I don't remember if Noodle bought it for me or if I bought it for myself or what. But yeah, I haven't actually read the book yet and I plan on reading the book before I, I take a look at the manga. Um, but it's another one, like I said, by the same author of I Had That Same Dream Again. And uh, I fucking love I Had That Same Dream Again. So I imagine this one's also gonna be really good. And uh, yeah, can't recommend them enough. It's a uh, uh, Yoru Sumino is the, the name of the, the author, and like, you avoided things that sounded like isekai. I mean, <laughs> uh, hold on, what what is the definition of, <laughs> of isekai? Uh, other world, yeah, no, 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 no. Uh, well, okay, I don't know. I thought that's what it meant, but I was just double checking. I do tend to enjoy isekai stuff, but I don't know about I want to eat your pancreas, right? Because like I said, I haven't actually read that, uh, on the back, it says, A deeply moving first-person story. An introverted high school boy finds his classmate's diary and learns her biggest secret. Uh, Yamauchi Sakura is dying from a pancreatic disease, and now he's the only person outside her family to know the truth. The last thing the boy wants is to be her friend, but Sakura's cheerful demeanor and their shared secret draw them together in this heart heart-rending tale of friendship and morality. Um... That's that's that one. But like I said, I haven't read it, so maybe it is Isekai in some way. I don't think so, though. S all three of the ones that I recommended are not Isekai. One of them... 
No, <laughs> like he doesn't go to another world, but small spoiler from one of them, they do meet a person from another world though, like a parallel world. Um, I had that same dream again. A high schooler who hurts herself, a young woman spurned by society, and an old woman spending her twilight years in quiet solitude, while Nanoka, a grade schooler with few friends, gets to know these three very different people she seeks to understand what they all have in common, and just what it means to be happy. As her budding relationship grows, perhaps she can find her own path to happiness. Uh, that's the other one. Like, yeah. You know nothing about it. The title just sounds... The title is fucking weird, man. <laughs> the title is really weird. But I... I Because uh, I loved I Had That Same Dream Again so much, I decided to pick it up anyways, even though I initially did avoid it because of the the uh, the title. Um, but yeah, I think... I think it's going to end up being good. I just haven't gotten around to... Reading it yet. I don't even think I actually bought the book yet. <laughs> Um, but between the three that I recommended, I had that same dream again, three days of happiness, and, um, I will forget this feeling someday. I think I'll forget this feeling someday is probably my favorite, maybe? I don't know, three days of happiness is also really fucking good, but again, they're all very bittersweet ending type of type of things um so yeah but cannot recommend them enough i recommend them to basically everybody um yeah i have found that i really like japanese authors <laughs> it's one it's the main reason other than like video games obviously that I wanted to learn Japanese and would still like to if I, I had the time and dedication for it. Because I want to read them in their native language. Because obviously, I mean, I love the English translations, but anything translated is going to lose some of the, the nuance, right? It's not going to be a perfect translation because you just, you just can't translate things perfectly from one language to another. There's always concepts and ideas and feelings um and languages that aren't going to be carried over perfectly in a translation and, and translations are always kind of up to interpretation of whoever's doing the translation too a lot of times so like yeah so yeah <laughs> that's that's like the main reason why i really wanted to learn japanese too but we'll see someday maybe but I'm not going to hold my breath on that. My vocabulary memorization skills are too poor. And my ADHD is god-awful. <laughs> so, like, yeah. Oh, well. Can't say much. You just recommend a show called Fully Cooly? Foley Cooley? What the fuck is that? Foley Cooley. Foley Cooley. Oh! <laughs> that's the FLCO. Okay. <laughs> okay. Foley Cooley. That's what that stands for. Okay. <laughs> it's. Oh, man. Whenever I searched for it. Foley Cooley? F O. Foley. Okay. 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 I was going to say, when I searched for it, Foley Cooley is what came up, but fucking phone i get it i get it um but anyways yeah no like crunchyroll had it listed as flcl so i didn't even realize like that was the actual name holy coolie <laughs> that sounds fucking stupid i'm not gonna lie i will watch it though because yeah i still need to finish uh march comes in like a lion too because i started it but i don't remember why i didn't finish it but i didn't end up finishing it I need to finish that one too. I remember you recommending that after I uh, was talking about what I'm gonna call it one day. The uh, You're a Lie in April, one of my favorite anime. Same studio as Evangelion. Wait, Fully Cooly is? That's pretty sick. I'm assuming it's nothing like Evangelion though. <laughs> it, it doesn't. It doesn't look like it's going to be in any way similar to Evangelion. 
I can't think of Evangelion now without thinking of Bring Me the Horizon, though. It's a problem. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I don't... Hmm. I'm not sure what that emote is, is means, but... Oh! Oh, shit. Okay. Well... I didn't... I didn't know that happened. I guess if we stand on the trees too long, we fall through them. My bad. Can we just... We can just go down here, can't we? Yeah. Oh, boy! Let's see if we can get through this this last level. I'm surprised, like... I'm extra surprised I have the I want to eat your pancreas manga. But I don't have either one of the other two. And I'm pretty sure both the other ones have manga versions. I could be wrong on that, but I thought they did. I just don't know why I would have bought I want to eat your pancreas first. But oh well. I'm going to have to double check on my Kindle now after the stream and see if I have I want to eat your pancreas. If not, I'm going to have to download it. I need to check, like, you think you got it for me? Okay, that's fair. I mean, I'm definitely happy to have it. I want all of them in manga form, both to support the author and because while I prefer books, I do like manga. I really enjoy manga. I need to read more of my manga in general because I still have... Death Note 2 and 3, Volumes 2 and 3. I have the Blackout editions for them. I don't know if I ever showed those on stream before, but they're pretty cool. So they're all blacked out. I have Attack on Titan, which I haven't read yet. I have uh, Yotsuba Volume 2 or 3 in Japanese. I haven't read yet. That one is... I just dropped my controller. That one's actually in Japanese, though, so I'm pretty slow at reading it. Um, A Silent Voice Volume 1 that I haven't read yet. Um, I think that's Black Co Clover that I haven't read yet. I have a couple Final Fantasy books that I haven't finished yet. I think I finished Drifting Dragons, I think. I don't remember. I have a lot of different things over there that I need to, that I need to read. But we'll get there eventually. <laughs> Sooner or later. Maybe I'll do a tiny bit of reading tonight. Actually, it depends. If by the time I get off of here in like four minutes, um, if whatchamacallit is out yet, solo leveling the next episode, I'm probably going to end up watching that and then showering and shit for tomorrow. But if not, then yeah, maybe I'll do one of those other things. From multiple My Hero Academia series? Yes, I have the My Hero Academia Volume 1. I have the like villain spinoff. And I think at least one other one as well, because your sister last Christmas got me like a set of them with like a few different ones. And then the only other like the only actual book books that I buy are fucking poetry books, man. <laughs> like, one sitting over here actually near the bed. a little dusty because it's been sitting like next to the bed instead of like sitting up in the the bookshelf but just wipe off the fucking dust real quick but these are the, these are the, <laughs> okay i i may not seem like a poetry guy i don't know and i don't really write poetry or anything <laughs> but <laughs> i enjoy poetry <laughs> so <laughs> fucking pillow thoughts man it's it's a whole series of uh of poetry that uh by who is it courtney peppernell and uh <laughs> i enjoyed her poetry so i have like four books from her <laughs> of just fucking poetry they said it's don't at me man it's fine i enjoy it it's uh they're like just short poems like but it's good stuff it it's like feels it's feel stuff you know Sorry, now I'm just reading. Uh, <laughs> here, what's the what's the first one? I wish my memory was better, because then I would just, like, quote some of them. But, like, I want to read a poem, Redeem? Bro, you got it. I just need to find, like, my, my first one. 
And uh, how many points should a read a poem redeem be? Are you allowed to read books on on stream? I I don't I imagine right. It's not like we're reading the whole thing in one sitting, anyways. Uh, fuck. Okay, settings. Your rewards. Channel points. Um. Rewards. Custom rewards. How much does it cost, man? Add a new custom reward. Give your reward a name. Read a poem. Okay, just call it read a poem. Stop what we are doing and read a poem. <laughs> That's the whole fucking redeem. Uh, no, you don't need text for it. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Pull down and limit. So it definitely needs to have a limit. But, like, redemption cooldown time? Uh, I would say only, like, once every half hour. No limit per stream. Uh, no, no limit, like, per user per stream. Color? I don't think we have anything that's pink. I don't think. Like, a like a baby-ish pink? I want it to be, like, there we go. Something like that. That looks good. I can't see like how much the other redeems are. <laughs> so how much is the like drink one? That one's like what, 250 or something? I think. I want this one to be a little more expensive. I have it in for 500 right now. Is that? Yeah, 250 are the other ones like hydrate or no, hydrate's only 100, but the votes are 250. Say hi is 500. Beating the dragons 500. Nah, two, 500 seems like a bit much. 250. 250. I'm lowering the cost. Save. There you go. There's a <laughs> 100. I mean, I guess we do have it like pretty limited. That's fine. Why not? I can always raise it if like it gets to be too annoying or something. But save. There you go. Discount it again. It's down to 100. <laughs> If this is going to be a thing, though, I need to go grab... Oh, no, the hydrate is 100. That's fine. You know what? Yay, discounts. I'm going to take it back to 250. <laughs> Suck it. <laughs> Discount taken away. It's still 50% off the original rate. But if this is going to be a thing, I legitimately need to go grab, like... Ah! The first book. <laughs> Fuck you. That's so rude. <laughs> Let me go read one anyway. Oh, <laughs> I will. Let me go grab the first one in the series. Might as well, like, do it in order, right? Because otherwise, there's no way I'm going to remember what's what. You guys like Snorlax, by the way? Oh, God. Why is it not? You're invisible. <laughs> uh, here we go. This is now, <laughs> we're now replacing one stream a week with wine and poetry. So <laughs> joke. No, I don't know. <laughs> ah, God. Okay. Let's see. So the way she does her books, um, they're like split up in sections for like, different feels rip more land yeah. <laughs> so this one here pillow thoughts the first one in the series by courtney pepperno um is the first section is if you are dreaming of someone and uh holy shit i need a bookmarker too here bonus we haven't done this in a while somebody have like a pen handy or pencil or something. If not, check the VOD, I guess. Because, uh... Oh, God. Not gonna see that. That's like... Yeah, good luck reading that shit. Hold on. 
It's a... Uh... <laughs> oh, ah, shit. I'll read first. Flowers on your doorstep. You deserve flowers on your doorstep and coffee in the morning. You deserve notes left on your dashboard and ice cream Sundays at 3 a.m. You deserve honesty every day and to be kissed every hour. You deserve to be reminded how beautiful you are. And if you let me, I will show you every day. I promise. Um, that was the first poem. There you go. Uh, <laughs> and the code, the code here is LJR2ZCZNYMJYG. Um, there you go. That's the, that's the, the code there for it. <laughs> Aww. Yeah. Said her shit's really good. I really like it. They're not poems in like the already used new sandwiches at three. <laughs> yes, <laughs> right. Same, <laughs> same. <laughs> I got you, boo. We can eat. We can eat ice cream sandwiches at three a.m. together. <laughs> Have a good one, man. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your night at work. <laughs> It didn't even work. <laughs> the fucking bot, dude. I think the 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 trigger has to be in the the front for the the bot to pick it up. Um. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> so I wish I could remember poetry because I'm fucking terrible at it. Should we decrease the timer from a half hour? I don't know. Half hour's probably fine for it. Why not? Now I just had to like remember because like there are two per page or not per page. Like it's it's one per page. But wow, that text is like so blown out. There you go. You can see it there. It's one poem like per page. So now I just have to remember which one we're actually on whenever we we get redeems for that. <laughs> God, what is this? Anyways, guys. <laughs> Bye, Chocobo. Bye, everybody else. Thank you for coming and hanging out. I hope you enjoyed your poetry. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you one more for free, just because, like, why not? Boy, what you saying, boy, to me for? I didn't do anything. I'm giving you one more for free. <laughs> I thought about kissing you today and yesterday and the day before that I know I'll think about kissing you tomorrow and the day after that and some more days after those days think about kissing you slowly and tracing my fingers along your lips I think about kissing you in your car in the rain on your doorstep think about kissing your dimple your cheek your spot I think about kissing only you not anyone else just you Ah, <laughs> they're so sweet that was by but type different. <laughs> oh, like boy. Okay, I got you. I'm used to seeing like boi typed like, you know, being or not typed like, but being boy. Like when I'm being yelled at by somebody, you know, <laughs> like usually my brother. <laughs> so like I thought you were yelling at me for something. I'm sorry. Goodbye, guys. <laughs> this 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 has gotten stupid enough. <laughs> See you guys in a couple days. Goodbye. <laughs> Be kind to each other and shit. <laughs>